last time. We are the Falco family, where every day is an adventure of faith and love. So we live and we learn. We asked you for some questions to include in our first Q&A back, and it was fun to pick a few to share. Are we sharing this year's unschool plans? My plans are to follow their lead, as always, to continue to pay attention to their strengths and weaknesses and look for opportunities for their growth individually and together as a family. I certainly want to share what that even looks like for us. It won't really come in just one post or one video, but rather as we share along the way. So we hope you'll stick around for as long as it blesses you. That brings us to what are our learning goals for this year? (laughs) Y'all, explore and discover by faith and with love is our forever goal. But this year in particular, our goals have much more to do with renewing our creativity. 2020 was our year to head out on our first Live and Learn tour, taking the foundations that we've established from years before and bringing it on the road to explore and discover with all of our friends. It was seriously a big launching pad for the next steps in our creative homeschool lives. But 2020 quickly became what we know it to be today and it turned our homeschool on its side. For the last three years, we've been adjusting and adapting much more of a structured and a bit more of a classical homeschool style. We started using curriculum, like actual curriculum. We started adding in heavy sports schedules and more traditional school-like routines. It was super, super hard, a super hard season for me as their mom and teacher, but they continue to thrive. We lived and we learned, we settled into the mundanity of it all, and now we all feel the season beginning to change. Our learning goal for this year has so much to do with reviving our creativity and jumping back in. I'm excited and I'm scared, but I'm placing all that fear at the feet of Jesus. I'm the class of 2027. Yes, you are. So what's challenging me these days? (laughs) This journey has been a ball of challenges from day one. But as I've matured, I've learned to invite each day's challenges and consider them joy. I'd say the thing that challenges me most in this current season is the busyness of it all. I am an introverted, slow and steady kind of girl. So learning to keep my calm in what feels like chaos is the actual goal. So we go on to answer a few more good questions, like how we meet their social needs, how I learn to guide my kids towards more independent work, what we use for grammar, whether or not they have a preferred studying style, and what we are looking forward to the most this year. So you can check the link in our description to get a bit more answers to the questions that we chose. Oh, and for the one that asks who these children even are, and the fact that you remember when they were tiny, exactly, friend, exactly. Our babies are growing, and in the whirlwind that is this world, I pray that they be anchored and immovable, rooted in love. Y'all, our kids have my heart, and I'm rooting for all of them. It's my desire to give you whatever I've got. So let's create a space where we encourage our babies, young ones, scholars, creatives with the gifts we've been given and the hope for a future that is bright. Hi! Hi. (laughs) What are we doing today? Filming. A Q&A. Savannah. And Cameron. And Kendall. We know we've been gone a while, but now we're back with some fresh new ideas and inspiration. Well, first of all, Cameron, Kendall, and I are all in seventh grade levels. And this year is my last year of elementary school. I like the walk, there are lots of activities. I like most of my seventh grade work actually. It's been good so far. And you're in high school. How do you feel about that? Yeah, I just enjoy getting better at um, accomplishing my work more efficiently. Other than that, it's not too different. How do you feel about 
feel about middle school? It does feel the same. Except for new. You guys were really the ones that encouraged me to get back out there and for us to start filming again and posting. Why? Well, we want to make new memories. I liked <coughs> watching our old films a lot. It was. Um, we used to do it all the time. Yeah, I just always liked filming. I love looking back at our memories on YouTube and seeing how much fun we have going to this place and going to that place and learning about this and learning about that. And I thought it'd just be fun if we could get back into it. We just want to share what we've been doing, what's been going on since our last post. You'll get to tag along with all of our tiny adventures. So we just do a lot more things than we actually show you got a lot more. <laughs> <laughs> Lucy, she broke loose. Lucy! This one, I guess she wanted to be a part of the mix. <laughs> now she's all content. Look at her. She <laughs> Go ahead, take your treat. Tours of where I craft, the supplies I have, types of things you can make, maybe little tutorials for little things you could build if you like crafting too. Where I get my materials from, what materials I use to build stuff like mechanical, robotic stuff, just paper crafts. From Lucy with love, it's following everything Lucy does. Bunny, I'm going to make a video where I show you all her space and what I can make for her to play during the day. Like a room tour. Yes, <laughs> a room tour. Mm -hmm. Show you around her enclosure, what she eats. Lucy's and... lounge. Oh, that's nice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you can look forward to all those videos from Lucy with Love. It's called Cooking with Kendall and Company. A cooking show. What I cook, how I cook. I do have guests. That's the company. I'm really excited because we can all be a part of each other's series. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So basically, we have so much to share. I still want to show you a room tour with Lucy in it and introduce you to Mommy's new truck, Joyride. And our Live and Learn tour. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like and, you know, whatever else is on YouTube. <laughs> Try it again. Try it again. <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe. And remember, Life is so very filled with lessons. And our goal, as always, is to live and, and to learn. learn. Good job, guys. Very good. <laughs> <Being> good. <laughs>